Okay, so I've abandoned the 130 can magazine because it's pissed me off. So I went with just a uh, 21 can um, S style shoot. That uh, feeds alright. Wish I could fit more in there, but I guess 21 will work. Um, this will be the third video. Uh, the next video I'm going to do some more uh, modifications to the pneumatic system, but right now I've got it working pretty good. It jams about one in every 30 cans, but uh, with the pneumatics it's probably the best you can get without getting some new parts, machining it, and so forth. And I have too much time into this one to play with it any longer. It works, we'll leave it at that. Okay, I'll stop the video and put some cans in and show you guys it crushing uh, again. Okay, there you go, 21 cans in there. I know in the last video I didn't really prove that it was uh, automatic, so this one I'll try to do that. See the cans in there. And, uh, let's fire the baby up. Okay, so I'll just hold the cans here. Okay, it stopped at the last can. It wasn't uh, heavy enough to trigger it. I'll let the cans go. As soon as the weight hits, she trips. Do it again. And holding the can. Stop in the last can. Oh, that one is heavy enough. Probably smokes in it. Okay, empty chamber. Let's can. Oh, jammed on the last one. Okay, so one can in there. We'll show you the chute here. Okay, so there's my automatic, pneumatic controlled can crusher with the new magazine. Yeah, so that was about 30 cans, one jam, it's about average. Alright, thanks for watching.